Being open is extremely important. The more open you are, the more likely you are to capture great pictures. It means not having your headphones on, is to not having your sunglasses on, listening to things, listening to conversations, and actually trying to find situations that are interesting. Allowing yourself to get lost is really important. In getting lost, you often find things. One of the key things with street photography is to find good places to actually stand and photograph. And one of the things that I tend to do is use the phone to sketch. There's a nice light on the floor. So I'm going to take a picture of it. Sketching is just pressing the button, getting into the, the, the journey. Get yourself going. You know, don't, don't paralyze yourself. Nothing's going to be a masterpiece until the masterpiece turns up. Finding a few things that interest you on your way that you pick up almost like memories. And I remember that there's nice light here on the floor. I'll come back to this some other time. It's almost like an artist would sketch a few thoughts or maybe just loosely pen a scene. You know, this hat, it's interesting. And at the end of the week, I'll look at places I've been. I can look at expressions, I can look at gestures. If you have these scenes and these thoughts in your phone, you can go back to the places, you can go back to those thoughts and refine them. For instance here, maybe just about see a face. For me, the pictures tend to resemble my personality. They tend to almost be a self-portrait. I don't know, maybe. When you go out with a positive mindset, you also stay hopeful and hope with street photography is very important. I just find it so interesting to look at people, see pe how people interact with each other, to see people's body language, what people wear. For me, it's the best feeling. Get out there, start sketching, start taking pictures, keep positive, and you'll find that anything can happen. <laughs>